Please welcome back to the stage, State Co-Chair Nathan Jones. All right, thanks. Great, uh, great panel there. Great discussions. We're in the home stretch here, folks. But uh, again, wanted to remind you, none of this happens without any of our great sponsors. So we've got some global sponsors we want to uh, thank. First of all, Sally, along with Stantec, Thinkwell, look at this, I'm syncing up, Triotech, and, and Wartzilla as well. All right, look at that. So those are our global sponsors for SAIT. Uh, give them a round of applause, please. We also have conference sponsors. We'd like to thank them as well. Uh, okay, thank you. Good cue, thank you. <laughs> yes, there we go. All right, we're going to start it off with Animax Designs, Color Reflections. See the pillows there? Color Reflections, good job. 11th Hour, Hotop, Woo! Scenario. Technifex, and little startup out of Vancouver Whitewater. <laughs> Round of applause, thank you. And now, please welcome for the final time, creative producer, Ariel Russell. Last time. Hey, Nathan, you wanna play some beer pong? No, no, bad, I'm kidding. I don't have ping pong ball. Um, cool, so we've had a lot of fun talking the past two days, I come with props this time, about creating a culture of coaching. Um, and, and really, the, the fundamental in all of that is building a strong foundation for your teams. Um, so real quick, show of lunch. Who did their lunch, or show of lunch? Can you guys tell it's the end of day two? <laughs> show of hands, who did their lunch homework? Okay, all right. How, I, I know, it's busy, you get talking. But like, for those of you who didn't, how many was it because it felt just a little too vulnerable and weird with a bunch of strangers, right? Ruminate on that. Um, that's okay, it takes practice, right? You, I, I, I encourage you to be brave and do what it takes to really embrace that vulnerability. Um, quick addition, because several of you stopped me after lunch and went, who's that little furball you kept mentioning? Just because I had to meet Franklin. Uh, <laughs> um, so anyway. Uh, um, <laughs> I talk about him all the time, those of you who know me. He's my Muppet, he's my sidekick, he's my furry assistant. Um, so, awesome sessions the past two days, right? And, and thank you so much to every single one of you who has come up and talked to me in the breaks and said this really resonated with me and I wanna take this back to my company and, and how do we do more of this because that's the whole point and that's what we wanna do. Um, I, I just encourage you to continue to ask those right questions, to create those safe spaces, to be vulnerable with your teams, empower and build up your employees and create a stronger workspace. Um, it's all about building a strong foundation, right? So we work in the building industry. We understand how foundations work. If you build a 10-story condo building in Florida and there's a big storm, that building is designed to sway. And, and that's okay because it has a strong foundation. It can sway. So props. Think for a minute. I am the solo cup, right? They're functional. They're great. They hold out 18 ounces. Songs have been written about them. Really talented ones might be able to catch a ping pong ball. Um, but they have their limitations. No matter what I do to this cup, it's never gonna hold more than 18 ounces, right? I mean, I could like attach other cups to it, but that's not this cup, 18 ounces. And also, fundamentally, a little bit weak, right? Can't take eh, a lot of pressure. Um, but if I think about me as one of these solo cups, and a whole team of other cups, and I take myself and I pour myself out into my team, I suddenly have more capacity, right? So I can take myself and pour out into my team, and then I have my creative director, right? And I have my associate producer, and I have my show writer, and I have my art director. Each one of us, as we continue to pour ourselves out into our team, start to build a stronger foundation. And the more we each pour ourselves out to those on our teams and those around us and those we work with, the more capacity we have to take on more ourselves. It's the fundamentals of delegation. 
and building something strong. And now, suddenly, what was inherently that weak cup isn't so weak anymore. And we've built a stronger foundation. And that's it from me, you guys. Thank you so much for the past two days. As I clean up and continue to talk to you awkwardly. <laughs> but that's it. You're on break, as far as I know, right? Yeah? Someone, voice of God. <laughs>